Hey G-Squad, welcome back to an episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we have this cool, amazing part right here. As you can see, basically what it is, is a space heater that's in use. But first thing first is actually open up the product to show you what it actually looks like and what comes in the package first. So when we first open the product itself, this is basically what it looks like and what it's provided in here. So they provide us a little warranty card and they also provide us a little instruction card, a user guide to teach you guys how to actually use the product. And then this is what it looks like right here, if you guys can see. So let me actually take it out and show you what it actually looks like. All right, so the first protection layer right here. And that's what inside the packaging itself. So let's take it out. So this is what the packaging looks like once you guys take it out, if you guys can see. Let's take out this part right here. All right, so this is basically what the product looks like, if you can see. So what's really cool about this is the fact that for this space heater, is the fact that this has dual PTC. So this one right here and one right there, if you can see. It definitely feels really nice, but obviously when you guys have it on, you guys don't want to touch this part right here, or you're just going to hurt yourself or burn yourself. On top part right here, you can see that they have the display screen, so you can actually see like the display on like different mode and which one's on and off. On top part, you can see all the different button controls that you can use on here, which is pretty awesome. But definitely one thing that's really cool about this product is the fact that it has little handles that actually carry with you guys wherever you guys want to, which is pretty awesome. If you guys take a look at the bottom part right here, they do have a little button right here. So this is the anti-tilt option, so once the product falls down because like a dog or your kids actually touch it and it tips over, it actually turns off by itself once this button is not pushed directly down on the ground anymore, if you guys can see. So that's definitely really cool. On the back part, you can see that there's a remote right here that is actually used to control it as well. And then there's a little fan right there to kind of like blow the hot air out to you guys, which is pretty awesome as well. And then for the little plugs that they use, is a US plug, if you can see right here. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself and how it looks like and everything. So the only way for us to actually find out how well it works and how to actually use it is to actually go turn it on. So let me actually plug this in first and try it out. All right, so right here we have the product all set up right here. You can see this is basically what it looks like. So once you guys want to turn it on, you can press the button on the top part right here to turn it on, or you can press the button on your remote right here. So I press it one time. It turns on the high mode, if you can see right there. You can change the high and low mode by pressing this button right here. You can see it's a low on there, high. You can change like the oscillating mode right here by clicking this button right here, the oscillating button right here. Right now, it's on low temperature and actually feels pretty nice already. You guys can also set a timer on here. You guys can see, it says one hour, two hours, three hours, four hours, five hours, and so on. So the maximum is around eight hours, you guys can see right here. So eight hours. And then there's the plus and minus. So the plus and minus is for increasing or lower the temperature. So if you guys want to increase it, just click the plus minus right here to increase it. So the maximum is 90 and the lowest is 41. So that's definitely really cool how you guys can actually change the temperature to the lowest temperature setting. So that way it can work both as a heater and also works as a uh, fan as well. And if you guys don't want to use the remote, you guys can always use the option on the button controls right here as well. So this is for turning off and on the product right here. And then this is for turning on the higher low mode, if you can see right there. And this button right here is for oscillating mode, so it actually moves the fan, if you can see right here. And this button right here is for increasing the temperature. This button is for uh, lowering the temperature. And this is for the little timer, if you can see right here, to set the timer if you guys want to use the option. Also really cool how it has a little handle right here that I actually uh, carry with you guys. So it's portable, which is pretty awesome. But one thing to note is that, like I mentioned earlier, is the fact that it has an anti-tilting. Uh, so if it does tilt for any reason, it actually turns off the product immediately. So let me actually lift this up to show you guys what I mean. So once I just like lift it up, it turns off like instantly. And once you guys put it back down, you guys can turn it back on. You guys can see. Or if you guys accidentally tilt it like this, it turns off as well. So it's definitely really cool how it has the option on the product itself. So that way it's really safe for kids and everything. So that's basically the test of the product itself. You can see this is basically what the product looks like overall. Definitely really cool design and definitely very different than a lot of other competitors or other brands out there today. All right, welcome back guys. So now you guys saw the quick test of the product itself. You can see it actually does work and it works quite well. Really, really easy to use. I definitely love the overall like build quality and the overall design of the product itself, if you can see. Really easy to control like the high and low setting, the oscillate mode option, the different temperatures. So you can actually use it as like, a heater or like a regular fan. So it's definitely really cool as well. And also the fact that it has a timer option that you can actually set between um, zero hours to eight hours. So that's actually a really long time as well. So this is totally perfect during like the winter season when it's really cold. And probably one of my favorite part about this product is the fact that it's so portable with the handle itself. And also the fact that it also has anti-tilt on the bottom. So if the product tilts for any reason, it actually turns off by itself. So that's actually a really cool option to have on the product itself for like safety reasons and everything. But now that we did a quick unboxing and testing on the product itself, 
now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I definitely have to say that it's actually pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially since like winter season is coming up soon. So you guys probably want to get like a space heater to kind of help warm up the space around your area or whatever, then this is actually pretty worth it. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have no use for one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that actually do need. But other than that, that's pretty much it for quick unboxing and testing of the product itself. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on that notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. And then for today's G-Squad fan shout out day we have,